mm, Peter, that was disgusting. <laughs> Seriously, Pete, mm, you have me round all the time. You cook me Michelin star food. <sighs> You're too good to me, mate. You really are. It's fine. I'm happy to. Mm, well, listen, when I get back on my feet and, uh, you know, paid my debts and things, I'm going to take you and Gemma out to that new Muse bar in town. Well, sweet James, there's no need. I like hosting. Besides, since Gemma's gone part-time, she always gets a big shop in. There seems a little point in going out when we both like cooking, you know? It's amazing what you can do for under £30 and a moderately priced wine. Is there something wrong? What's just happened? Oh, sorry, are you full? <laughs> Am I full? Pete, your cake's about four times bigger than mine. I mean, why is that? Because I'm the bigger man, James. <sighs> it all makes sense now. The invitations, the holidays, giving me your old golf clubs. Because they're not good enough for you anymore, are they? James, I didn't mean it. No, like... Pete, I, I don't want to hear it. You've humiliated me enough. <clears throat> oh, James!